Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Angry Dad Vibes. Uh, this is going to be a Leo reading for March 29th to April 2nd, 2021. And of course, there's a whole bunch of Leos out there, so this is not going to be every single Leo story. Take what's yours, leave the rest alone. Also, feel free to swap around the energy. I could always be talking to a cross watcher or someone that you're dealing with. Um, the readings had slowed down because I was in the process of moving, but now I'm like officially situated in my new apartment. I already have internet set up and I am, um, I am a college student again, so I'm just going to have to make a schedule and get used to it, you know, that way I could stay active on YouTube for you guys. Uh, all right, so Leo, March 29th, April 2nd, 2021, Leo, you versus them. March 29th to April 2nd, 2021, Leo, Lash up. Okay, buy the book, Leo. So you could be trying to like do things the right way, um, exchanging gifts, and it could be with friends and family. You know, it's like buy the book. It's like you have uh, rules. It's kind of like rules. You have your own rules that you're trying to follow. Um, you're also trying to do things the right way. Like on paper, it would be how certain relationships, the fates, and it could be in a relationship, a destined relationship. You know, you guys are trying to do things Technically, like on paper, how it would be how it's supposed to be done. I don't know. Kind of like, I don't know, um, everything half and half. Or the, or maybe going back to, you know, your own beliefs. Like, I don't know, the man does everything and the woman is, I don't know, cooking and cleaning at the house. Meanwhile, the man is the one trying to provide for all the bills. You guys just have your own rules, okay? Uh, whatever rules they may be, you guys are, are doing those rules. And I feel like that what i just said is for some of you guys i mean i'm knowing i'm, I'm not gonna say whether or not i agree with them but i feel like that that rule that i said is for some of you guys you know some of you guys might be trying to take on the stay-at-home mom role others of you guys are taking on the the providing role you know what i mean all right a leg up you see it's like your guys are helping each other out a leg up um, milk and honey, you guys are compatible. You guys are probably choosing to try to work together as a team. Meanwhile, the person that you're dealing with, you know, in the past, they could have fought this connection. They could have fought you, uh, fought the relationship. And here, blessed, you know, they're realizing this is a good thing, you know, to have this person to have my back and vice versa. It's a good thing. Treasure Island. And that is, that is what makes it valuable is the fact that they're choosing to believe it is. A message in a bottle and if you guys are separated this could be someone messaging you because they're wanting to help you out and you help them co-create um this could be something that yeah no i was gonna say that you brought in it's like you co-created with the universe to bring this situation in a loyal heart this could have been someone that was unloyal to you it doesn't say loyal body it says loyal heart so they were unloyal to you, but you might have this deep knowing that they're kind of going through a lot and that it's only a matter of time after they get their emotions in check. Um, once they become at peace, then they'll come forward, community. You know, it's like right now they could be listening to other people and that's going to change here, a change in the wind. Um, then they're going to be watching you and then they're going to come forward. See, a higher power, the most high is going to make them make a choice, a fork in the road. New life. Do you still want to be here? Or do you want to be over there with that person? And they have a choice to make. So, let's see. Leo, March 29th. But that's in the future. Let's see. Currently, March 29th, April 2nd, 2021. Or March 30th, April 2nd, 2021. Leo. March 30th, April 2nd, 2021. Leo. One more shot for him. Family harmony. Yeah, this is like a family dynamic. You guys are learning how to milk and honey, work together as a team. You are a spiritual teacher. Um, if you kind of learn how to balance out this relationship by watching tarot card videos and stuff like that, um, now you can kind of show people what you've learned. You can kind of tell people, yeah, you know, I used to be at that point with my significant other and we worked it out by X, Y, and Z. See, cleanse your energy. Yeah, just cleanse the past, you know. Um, you can't just... Let me read it to you. It says, oh, I lost it now. Whatever. Okay. 
laughter. Yeah, try to be happier. Uplift yourself and those around you through loving laughter. Both of you guys need to just smile, okay? Try to crack jokes with your person. Uh, meanwhile, your person, uplift your thoughts. You know, they need to think more positive. Focus your attention on the many blessings that surround you. By doing so, you'll let go of depression, poor self-esteem, and excess weight. Again, they need to look at the positive in this relationship. You know, maybe in the past, they saw it as, oh, this person's always smothering me, and I just want to do things by myself. But now they're realizing, like, why should I have to do things by myself? You know, it's it's a good thing that I have someone like this that's willing to help me, and I don't have to do everything by myself, you know? Um, family Harmony here, it says, your loved ones form a strong pillar of support. Embrace their love and put the past issues behind you. So it could just be with friends and family that you're kind of putting past issues behind you. But I feel like this is more of a relationship dynamic. You guys are kind of learning how to be more compatible, how to work together as a team. So Leo, March, 20, March 30th to April 2nd, 2021. One more shuffle. Leo, March 30th to April 2nd, 2021. Me versus them. Leo, the chariot. See, this is the balance between the dark and the light. A balance between the masculine and the feminine. A balance between the action and them not doing anything. Okay, that's being blown up here, the tower card. You guys were probably both trying to do too much. You know, you're trying to control it. They're trying to control it. Three of Wands. This is patience and planning. You guys just need to be patient. You know, take things day by day. Let things fall into place. Um, oops, Ten of Swords. So your person doesn't want to end this here with that Ten of Swords upside down. Um, but they are probably ending things to be with you. Your intuition could be telling you that already. That they're going to reach out to you, Leo. Um, you probably have been waiting a long time for this person to change. And it could be, you know, listening to friends and family, three of cups. Listening to what society thinks. Like society thinks you should, I don't know, get your own place and car by this age. You know, things like that. Where it's like just being patient. Like, you know what? It's okay. I could do things my own way, my own time. And that's Okay. You know, so with that three of cups and uplift your thoughts and blessed, I feel like, you know, they kind of get influenced by the people around them and it tends to make them feel bad about themselves. And with the emperor card here, this is something they're learning to control, you know, ace of cups. They're wanting a, a loving relationship with you. It's also because you love yourself enough. Um, you could have pulled back your energy, chose to love yourself. Meanwhile, this person is wanting to bring calmness well that brought calmness into the situation with that blue rose the color blue represents calm so you loving yourself brought calmness into this situation yeah we have two blue roses calm and the sun card which is happiness judgment so your person could be having a choice to make about starting a new cycle with you here with the world card two hands and again, in this time, this has been like a huge lesson learned. It's like I could have wasted less time. I didn't have to waste so much time. This is also like waiting. You could have waited a long time. And that is bringing in a commitment because you're probably the only person who hasn't really ever gave up on this person before. You could be dealing with an Aries, a Taurus, a Pisces. Yeah, so you see here, Three of Cups. You guys can now come together and have a future a family even for some of you guys with the sword of truth right there with this person making up their own mind they probably again like i said in the past listen to other people this is something that they're going to move forward because they're evolving as a person the empress and emperor it's like being cool calm and collected by themselves so they could speak up about what they want which is having a new beginning a passionate new beginning with you um there could be some haters that, you know, they kind of had to leave in the past because they love you, you know, three of swords. And I feel like they're kind of hurt by being separated from you. This is what's causing them to change their mind where it's kind of like, you know, do I really want to keep dealing with these people in my life or do I want to go be happy with my Leo? And so Knight of swords, they're wanting to come rushing in. The priorities are kind of still all over the place. Um... So there could be kind of some doubt there where some hesitation where they don't really feel stable. But this is something I feel like they'll tell you with that King of Swords, King of Wands. Yeah, yeah, the full card, Two of Wands. I mean, they've already made their mind up. 
they don't like not seeing any effort from you. They don't like it. So it's like, you know, they're wanting to come show, make a decision. They're wanting to show it. So with the Three of Cups, the Emperor, you see, it's like, now it's like they're so determined to have you and cut off these other people. What's the Temperance card? Leo, March 29th, April 2nd, 2021. Temperance. So you just have to be patient because Seven of Wands, they're learning boundaries. They're learning how to stick up for themselves. The Hierophant. See, it's like they learned not to play pretend. With that Page of Cups upside down, they could have kind of lied to you in the past, told you what you wanted to hear. And um, Page of Cups upside down. Now it's like, what's the Page of Cups upside down? Yeah, that was you guys going in cycles. But now it's like, um, now they have more confidence. Now they want to give you attention. This could be something that you manifested by you being happy by yourself. This brought in a brand new opportunity that now you guys can move forward. What's the Ace of Swords, Leo? Ace of Swords, another card, Leo. Thank you. Five of Swords. So it's like now they realize that um, the Five of Swords often upside down is often be careful who you tell your secrets to. So this is something that they learned with that Ace of Swords, Five of Swords, upside down, Four of Pentacles. To, you know, be careful who they tell their secrets to. Now they need to hold back. With that Four of Pentacles, they need to um, choose to spend more time by themselves and more money on themselves. You know, they probably have a lot of yes people around them like, yeah, man, forget her, forget him. You don't need them. You're better off by yourself, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, yeah, but then they're by themselves and they want, if this person wants someone in their life, well, then that's horrible advice. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, uh, what's the Ace of Cups, uh, Leo? So, you see, you love yourself. You didn't put any effort towards this person, Nine of Wands, because you probably had a lot of doubt about this moving forward. You know, you were like, you know what? I don't know the way this person's being. I don't know if this will work out anymore. Ten, ten of Swords, Leo, March 30th, April 2nd. So it's like you have regrets about ending the relationship because I feel like that was kind of a head over heart decision um, for our cups and you're not really seeing any progress from it, you know, from you ending it. What's the judgment card, Neo? March 29th. So now it's like um, you're probably deciding, you know, if you should keep trying, if you should do something about it. With that seven of cups, I feel like you should work on your priorities on reorganizing your priorities, you know, make make sure your priority for sure. What's the page of pentacles in the world card? Meanwhile, this person, they're at this checkpoint where it's kind of like you reap what you sow. Um, the seven of pentacles is often having to make a decision. Do you want to keep on doing things the way you've been doing them or do, do you want change? So with this hanged man here, um, I feel like they're making a choice, you know, they're changing their mind right now about whether or not they want to reach out, about whether or not they want to have a cycle with you, it's the world card, see, five of wands, six of pentacles, they're fighting themselves, this can be equal, give and take, this is six of pentacles, as in, um, and they know it, with that knight of swords, they want to come rushing in, because you probably give a lot to this person, Leo, but the Hermit card, you know, it's like they don't feel worthy of it. They don't feel deserving of it. So, one moment. So, I feel like it's only a matter of time till you see something from this person. I feel like they're barely switching their perspective and realizing the benefits in this relationship. You could also be dealing with a Virgo, a Cancer, an Aries. Leo, March 29th, March 30th, April 2nd, 2021. March 30th, April 2nd, 2021, Leo. Worth waiting for. So this is more waiting. You guys are both going to be just waiting in this time span still. Leo, March 29th, March 30th to April 2nd, Leo. March 30th to April 2nd, Leo. Honey, 
honeymoon. See, your person is working on their emotions. Romantic feelings. The feelings are real and worth exploring. In the future, um, I feel like you guys are going to come together because this is true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. Trust. And in the future, you guys are going to have to have trust. But it came out upside down, so I feel like the trust is already there because the love is um, the love is a lot. See, passion here on top of family harmony. I feel like you guys are learning how to balance out passion, the wants, the desires. And here in the bottom of the deck, we have it is safe for you to love. So right now, you guys are both learning that how to be vulnerable, both learning that it's okay to be um, open up and to trust someone. Leo, March 29th, March 30th, April 2nd, Leo. Can I get one more card for out of the deck? Leo's person, March 30th, April 2nd. March 30th to April 2nd, 2021, Leo. See, they have to stay optimistic about their love life. Um, with this deception card sideways, I feel like they tend to put on a mask and pretend like they think everything's okay. At the same time, they think everything is not okay. And this is something that they have to just kind of be open and honest with you and tell you, like, you know, I just feel like we're not in a good place. Or they need to tell you, you know, I feel like, you know, I think we're good with where we're at right now. Um, that way it doesn't cause any confusion. Here it says make the effort and children. So if this person shows you that they care, um, I feel like it is safe for you to flirt back. Flirt. You know, um, and then it is safe for you to love. So if this person shows you that they care, it's okay for you to make the effort. And it's okay for you to um, be, let your child, um, your childhood your child self shine you know what i'm saying like it's okay to be like creative and like i want to watch a movie and ooh, i think we should go out like and i think we should get you know make cupcakes and you know it's okay to be your child self with this person i i feel like you know it is safe for you to be your child self you know um i'm not saying you have to go and be childish with this person and you know act like that but i feel like it is safe for you to act like that um, if you want to act like that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, meanwhile, over here, heart to heart conversations in the future. Again, my cards like to follow up past, present, and future. Over here in the future, you guys are going to have heart to heart conversations and you guys are going to open up more. But that's in the future. In the future, again, I feel like the trust is going to be there because the love is there because you guys are going to be more open and honest with each other. Meanwhile, I feel like your person, again, you know, I feel like they are learning how to be more, think more positive about the relationship. Leo, March 29th, March 30th, April 2nd, Leo. March 30th to April 2nd, Leo, one more shuffle. I feel you leaving me behind. So, Leo, they think you're moving on from them. March 30th to April 2nd, Leo. And that could be why they're kind of realizing... The benefits in this relationship where it's kind of like before I lose Leo you know it's kind of like or maybe you threatened to leave and so now they're starting to realize you know actually I, I want Leo Leo's actually a good person you came closer than anyone see they have issues opening up um, my life is not together as it seems they again uh, I feel like you know they're not really stable Finding out the truth crushed me and they realized, you know, this is kind of their fault and always thinking negative and probably getting advice from other people who don't really support the relationship. That's another issue in the relationship that they're realizing now. We also have here, I know that I crossed the line with you. They know that it's kind of their fault. I replay our conversations over and over. They have not stopped thinking about you. I hide behind material things. So they tend to put money first. I am becoming a better person. This is something they're working on. I bury myself in work to forget you. And that landed on this um, deception. So you might think that all they care about is work. That's the lie here. They care about you. I'm grateful for the spiritual lesson. They've learned a lot from this connection. As for you here, it says, I wish you could take back my words. You know, maybe you've said things out of anger. Or you said some things, um, you know, out of niceness that you kind of wish you didn't say because... You know, you're not really getting anything back from this person. But I'm here to tell you that they do love you, okay? Just some people can love you with their whole heart and have a crappy way of showing it with their actions, okay? 
And it's due to, like, childhood traumas and stuff like that, you know, or just people are just a crappy person, you know, in general. They're just a crappy person. And this is something that I feel like um, they're working on, um, you know, whether they were crappy towards you or not. I feel like they listened to other people and they tended to tell secrets to other people or they would just let other people kind of decide things for them. And this is something that they're learning to master, like only listening to themselves. See, um, uplift your thoughts and blessed. I feel like they're learning how to convince themselves that, you know, what they have is actually good. You know, this is also um, two. This is also a four. So this is another card of them learning how to hold back from people. Meanwhile, this is a seven here. I feel like, you know, you guys are learning boundaries in this relationship. You know, learning proper giving, proper taking. Um, you, this is a card of six. Again, I feel like this is going to be more stable, more compatible. But it has to start with this person believing that this relationship can work out. But all right, guys, much love. If this resonates with you guys, you guys are more than welcome to like, share, leave a comment, and subscribe. Much love. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please take care of yourselves, and I'll be talking to you guys later. Thank you. Bye.